Chaz Marler from Pair of Dice Paradise here, and if it's one thing that I know that people like, it's stuff. I mean, people's stuff is just all over the place. And the only thing that people like more than stuff is free stuff. Which is one of the reasons why, since 2002, crowds of consumers have flocked to their favorite comic book shops on the first Saturday in May each year for Free Comic Book Day, where participating comic book retailers give away specially printed copies of comic books at no charge. It's like, it's like Christmas! Except that it's in May instead of December, and instead of Santa Claus running the show, you have his older counterpart, Stanley. Well, anything successful is bound to eventually spawn sequels, and Free Comic Book Day is no exception. Which is just one of the reasons why we're just days away from a similar event, Local Comic Shop Day, where the comics aren't free, but participating retailers do receive exclusive toys and comics to sell, such as this exclusive one-shot issue of The Tick, so sweet, or the perhaps even more fantastic, long-awaited and highly anticipated Archie Meets the Ramones, which is a project that, apparently, at no time during its production had anyone involved in it pause long enough to consider completely abandoning it to go work on absolutely anything else instead. So while local comic shop day is great news for lovers of both comics and the seminal punk rock sound, what does it have to do with board games? Well, the company USAopoly, publishers of the recently very well-received game Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle, and enough variations of Monopoly to fill a rock and roll high school, will be participating in the next local comic shop day, scheduled to take place on Saturday, November 19th. For the event, USAopoly will be releasing a kit to retailers which features some very exclusive promos, including a Vulcan Mind Meld promo card for Star Trek Panic, a Sunshine Daisy promo card for the Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle game, and several promos for Marvel Munchkin. Oh, and sure, even though when compared to the guitar-shredding adventures of the gang from Riverdale, the promise of getting mere board game promos may make you want to be sedated, this is still exciting news for gamers. It's, it's one more instance in a growing list of examples of board games crossing over into other areas of geek culture and the media, which can't be anything but good for the health of the industry. So, here's what I want to know. Will you be taking advantage of local comic shop day to procure some board gaming promos for yourself? And if so, let me know what you found and what you ended up getting. I'd love to know in the comments below. Gabba Gabba Hey indeed, Archie. Gabba Gabba Hey.